hi guys welcome back to my channel if it was your first time here and you're seeing this face for the first time and you're thinking who's this well my name is Goku. i am also known as sne and as Goku on all my social media platforms do feel free to follow me because i really do drop some dope content <laughs> welcome to yet another review video and today i am reviewing my faves my all-time all-time faves my number ones bye bye stations now before we start i'd like to put a disclaimer out there that this i will be reviewing a luxury rather two luxury items that are replicas and i know that there are people who are highly highly against using replicas i'm not one of those people um if you don't like replicas or you don't like videos about replicas um you can stop watching right now because this is definitely not for you but if you are looking to ball if you are looking to look cute on a budget a ball on a budget and have the next best thing at a lower price this video is definitely definitely for you let's begin <laughs> so in today's video i'm coming back with another buy by station uh bag and shoe review uh if you're new here you probably don't know what is bye bye station so bye bye station is an online shop that is based in china that sells high replica uh luxury items i'm talking about your gucci your louis vuitton christian dior valentino fendi whatever you want they have it all you have to do is uh send them a dm this is their instagram page or send them a whatsapp i'm gonna leave their whatsapp number underneath uh you can uh, contact joanne and she will assist you a very very nice lady so let's get into today's review a quick disclaimer um this is the packaging the bag came with i don't want to lie to anyone i've opened this and put the bag i've only kept the bag for you guys to show you but it did come nicely wrapped in the uh gucci in gucci packaging and it also came um it came with the with the gucci box so i took it out because i have been using here the pictures of how i style the bag it's truly an amazing bag it's a versatile bag that you can style and when you're wearing formal it's a bag that you can style when you're wearing casual uh semi-casual it's the bag you want to have that will never let you down like it's one bag that will always be there it also comes with the gucci dust bag of which this is where i keep my bags i don't really keep the boxes i just keep them um to show you guys that they do come with the boxes but one thing that i do keep is this to keep the dust off my bags so drum roll please so this is the bag so this is called the gucci padlock leather and uh printed canvas yes this is the gucci padlock leather in printed covers bag the reason they call it the gucci padlock is because it has a padlock here this padlock and the padlock comes with let me push it down for you to see the padlock comes with a key i'm just trying to pull it out for you there it goes so it's a gucci padlock and it comes with the key you can lock your bag and you can unlock it the lock does really work so it's called a gucci leather and a printed canvas because here it is pure leather this is also leather and at the back here you can use this to hold your cards or put whatever you want to put uh, this is also leather and this is leather so and this is the gucci canvas i love that they are gucci um people look at this to identify if the bag is really not you can see that the lines do align even at the end here the design is top notch up to stretch i did go to uh, gucci prior to choosing this uh bag and just to view and see how the real one looks it looks quite similar i'd give it a 90 percent look the only thing that is different from the real one is this chain this chain is quite a bit light than the real one the, the real one that i saw in the store was a lot heavier but it still looks good 
it's not a train smash everything else i don't want to lie to you the stitching the canvas the aligning of the g's look uh, pretty similar to me so we are done with the packaging of the bag and how the bag looks and so personally on how i styled the bag i styled it uh, in a formal way i also styled it in a casual work way and the bag worked i did a formal look let's say if you're going to the office or you have an interview and you really want to look formal but you want to add the taste of sophistication you just want to upgrade your look a little this bag will do just that i love that the bag does not have a canvas all the way it doesn't scream gucci but you know it's gucci it's it's just a a, a, a pinch of gucci with the canvas going only halfway here when you know you know uh the bag is not heavy at all it's cute it works uh it's not too i know there's a touch of gold but it's not too much it's just enough to go with your formal wear and when you want to go casual with the bag you can absolutely do so i did it with a cute uh sundra sundress and a cute um and a cute pair of sneakers and i also felt that it really really worked it just blended in as i've shown you with the other people that uh, have the bag they do rock it formally and they do rock it uh, in a casual way disclaimer alert disclaimer alert i need to say this every time i put this up just because i'm placing a person here does not mean uh, i'm saying they're using replicas i'm a i'm a regular regular just like you I'm no celebrity. I don't know any celebrities. I don't know any famous influencers. I should really switch this phone off. Sorry about that. As I was saying, I'm a regular. I'm a regular person. I don't know any influencers, famous influencers. I don't know any famous celebrities to even say uh, I've seen them with that bag. But I see them on Instagram. Obviously, I'm gonna link their Instagram pages and i love how they style them how they style the bag and i love them as celebrities and i love them as um influencers just people that i admire people that i go to for style inspo or for luxury items because they're always in the game with those things so disclaimer i don't know these people i'm not saying their bags are fake they're most likely real but just for inspo and just to get just to show you how much is the bag out there all right so the first person that i've seen with this bag is with this bag is the most <laughs> this lady lives such a luxurious life whenever i feel down and demotivated i go to instagram page and i'm motivated to wake up and work she literally makes me believe that there's a luxury life out there that is waiting for me i just have to work hard and get it and her name is the beautiful shante yankes <gasps> Check out her Instagram page. It's luxury from A, B, C, D to Z. It's luxury everywhere. I love her. She's so pretty. I love her style. Uh, she has everything luxury that you can even that you can think or dream of. The places she travels. I am manifesting everything that Shanti Yanka says in her prayers. Lord, I am saying it too bless me bless your suffering cat i'm a suffering cat guys so uh this is how she styles the bag this is how she rocks the bag and i think it's her fave too because i've seen it i've seen her with it a few times more than she uses other bags according to <laughs> okay i've seen her on instagram actually i've seen her working there but on you know a page if a person loves a bag you can tell oh this is a favorite favorite bag she's always carrying it because she has other options but she keeps using this one i think she loves loves it and then uh the second person is the coolest dj in the blog i love her so much she's so beautiful she's so cool she's so out there and i also feel like she's so humble it's lamise holworthy <sighs> you guys i aspire to be these women one day I just feel like maybe i just have to start here for now and then i'll get there where they are 
I've seen her with her back, I've seen her rocking it, I've seen her wear it like in a cute white dress, I've seen her making it like in rocking it in an edgy way. Love, love how she styled it. She's one of the people that just pushed me to get the bag. And she's one of the people that I when I go to a page, I always look at luxury because I know I'm gonna spot it with oh she has this luxury, oh this is in and she loves the latest okay maybe not the latest bags but she, she she's a cool girl she loves cool cool trends and love her she inspires me a lot her personality her music her career and of course her bags her bags i love all her bags um makes me excited just speaking about let me love love her and the last one i'm going to name is an influencer boys oh I love how she styled uh, this bag. She wore it with a casual jean and a shirt. And you can see on um, Shante's uh, 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 um, Instagram post, she's wearing it more formal. And then Lamise is mixing it edgy, formal. And she's also looking it with a cute dress. And then um, Boyd's comes in with a jean and a top and a white shirt. I'm thinking, Mm, I need this bag. It's versatile. It's out there, and the who's who's of the game have it. So I have to have it too. Influenced. <laughs> so yeah, uh, I love women on Instagram. Like I, I love women on Instagram. I love beautiful women. I love their beautiful taste and how they dress and how they style. I'm sorry if you can hear that. There's construction here. Okay, now let's talk about. Uh, prices so i did go to gucci in waterfront to look at the bag as i've said before so this bag costs 31,000 rands uh at gucci 31 and then when you go and try and buy it on bye bye station uh you are going to pay 4,000 rands uh for this bag on bye bye station so you're saving about 27k yeah you're saving about 27,000 rands even if um you just came here to get inspo and you don't want to buy from papa station that's still fine we respect you we love you but if you want to take that route uh save about um 4,000 rands to spend of this bag i think it's affordable uh taking in consideration that they do use real leather guys guys you can't buy real leather at a cheap cheap price again i must say it it's not gucci leather but it's leather do you understand so i think that's why it's so pricey uh yeah what did i miss oh yeah um uh delivery it takes about two weeks it's, i i think i've said this before it takes about two weeks for the bag to get to you from china to hear from the date of purchase so it's about give yourself about 14 days 14 working days and the bag will be not even 14 working days just 14 days including weekends because when you track it on aramex the bag keeps moving uh and yeah how would i rate this bag overall i think i've said it i'd give it a solid nine out of ten how would i rate the service at bye bye station i'd give them 10 out of 10 for communication for a prompt response i'd give them 10 out of 10 for packaging 10 out of 10 um uh, for service delivery overall and customer service love love bye bye station their fave i believe in them i believe in their products I, I wouldn't lie to you if there's a fault i would say it at this point i got nothing <laughs> and the last quick review i am going to do is a Louis Vuitton unboxing of my Louis Vuitton sandal so this is the sandal from bye bye station actually this is um it was released in the previous years there's a new one that came out i just have always loved it and i wanted to have it and of course i asked for it from baba station the sandal is gorgeous and also with like with the other bag with the bag they also use um uh, leather it was shipped together with the bag the shoe does cost uh, 199 dollars on the papa station side 
off that of which that is three thousand rands obviously the rent fluctuates but it will always be around that price i love this sandal i styled it with my casual shirt black shirt dress and it went in so well and i also styled it with uh the Gucci bag that I was just showing you guys right now, they go so well together. And I also styled it this way with a casual uh, a summer dress because I will be wearing this in summer. Obviously, it's a sandal, you can't wear it in winter. <laughs> but yeah, um, I styled it with a black summer dress and it went. It's gorgeous. I love it. It's a very. I've always wanted it. I've always loved it, and it 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 really gave me the look that I was looking for. Uh, just a quick one on who I've seen wearing this um, this shoe. It's my fave, Boichi. I haven't seen anyone else rocking this shoe, but I saw Boichi rocking it with a cute casual look. Obviously, I said it's it's a sandal. What else can you rock it with? <laughs> love, love it. I'm obsessed with this shoe. Thank you Popeye Station for this. I love it so much. It's literally perfect. It's so comfortable. You can wear it the whole day. Oh my God, you guys. Thank you so much for joining me. I had so much fun reviewing this bag. I have so much fun reviewing a family that I believe in, which is Popeye Station. Thank you so much for checking out the time in your busy schedule and sitting down and listening to me and my friends at Popeye Station. We'll see you guys next time. Stay blessed and stay cute. Bye guys. Love you.